Alright, so the first step we need to do is to pair up the two NXTs with the Bluetooth. So I'll start by just turning them on. So I can see I've got Rocky on this side and I've got Kimmy on this side. What I'm going to set up, I'm going to set up Rocky as the master, talking to Kimmy as the slave. First things first though, we need to enable the Bluetooth. So, just in my menu here, I'll go across, find Bluetooth, click the on off to select on, it's now saying turning on. I'll do the same over here with Kimmy, across, find the Bluetooth, and turn it on. So they're now both saying turned on. If we look up in this top left hand corner you'll see the Bluetooth symbol plus one half of a diamond on the side there. That one half is saying that we're currently not connected to anything. Once we've got the other side of the diamond we know we're connected. Alright, because we're going to have Rocky as our master and Kimmy as our slave, Kimmy doesn't need to do anything. She can just sit there and wait. Rocky needs to find Kimmy. So we're going to go back into our Bluetooth menu and I'm going to find I'm going to navigate to the search option, there's that little magnifying glass. I'm just going to click the orange button here to start searching. What it's doing now, it's going through and finding any Bluetooth device at all that it can find. Every time it finds a Bluetooth device, it pops up a little question mark. Now, if you're doing this in class, you may end up with seven or eight or even more question marks as it locates all the devices that are Bluetooth. So, the question mark says it's found something and it's just waiting until it can actually figure out what it is. There we go, so it's finished doing that. I can see there that it's got my computer. It's got an NXT called NXT, one called Mickey, one called Lint, one called Damien, one called Johnny Five, and there's Kimmy. So now by doing the search there, I've found Kimmy. So I've selected that, press the orange button. It's now asking what connection slot we can connect to. With these Bluetooth devices, we can have one master can connect to three different slaves at any one time. Because I'm just doing one connection here, I'm going to choose connection slot 1, which is already there, and press the orange button. It's now saying connecting. Now, if you haven't connected before, it'll pop up a little menu that says pass key, and then once you see that pass key one, it'll say 1, 2, 3, 4. Just press the orange button on both devices and you'll be fine. I've connected these two before so it's remembered that I have connected those and if you look now very carefully up in that top right hand corner you'll see a full diamond same on this side here that full diamond is telling us that we are now connected via Bluetooth if we ever lose the connection I'm just gonna turn off Rocky here alright Rocky's turned off and we'll see on this side here that Kimmy has gone down to a half diamond because we've lost that connection I'm gonna turn Rocky back on And rather than going through that whole searching procedure again, what I can do is I go into Bluetooth, and instead of going to the search option, instead of going that magnifying glass, I'm going to come to this one here which says My Contacts. So My Contacts is a list of all the NXTs that you've connected to in the past. So rather than searching for it and having to wait for that, I can just flick through in my contact list, find Kimmy, and go Connect on Connection Slot 1. It's saying Connecting watching that little diamond there and there we go full diamond and we've got our connection back and that's how we connect up two NXT's together via Bluetooth